Hey YouTube, it's me, it's your knife on Captain. Today I'm going to be doing a update review on deck. It's a tweak that adds a toolbar to the side of your springboard or screen if you want to call it that. And it can be set to an activator. And I have mine set to tap the status bar one time and it opens it. Now, you're looking at what deck looks like right here. You see it's a little toolbar and over here where it's solid black you can change that and put your springboard back in its place. You can lighten it or darken it as much as you like. And to do that you simply go into settings and this is something that, that they added in the update and it's the dim screen. Okay, You can decrease and increase it right here. Personally, I don't like it. I'm just going to leave it off. All right. Also, in the update, they added the left side. Now you can put it on the right or the left. In the first version they released, you could, it only was on the right-hand side of the screen. Now you can choose if you want it on the right or the left. And they've got, you can set it to your custom actions to come up first or your toggles or the deck they call the just regular deck toolbar your custom actions are these actions that you set right here action one two three through six and what that is is personally it's just your favorites is what I refer to it as and when you open it you see right here this is the custom actions that I set and you get the little arrow up here you can tap the arrow and here are your deck tools if you want to call them that that's your deck tools and here is your toggles the toggles they refer to as things like 3g volume airplane mode location all that sort of stuff so and also in this update they add this little settings right here the little cog looking icon if you tap that it takes you straight to the settings menu where we were just at setting to set up or configure these settings for deck all right here's your activator where you set your activation here you can change it to anything you like under here personally I like to have mine on the status bar because it just makes it easier to know where it's at all right and they also added in the camera app, it was just the uh, iPhone camera. Now they've added Camera Plus. But of course you have to have Camera Plus downloaded on your phone or it wouldn't work anyway. So that's a, that's a feature they added. And under the musics, they've added Pandora, Spotify, Audio Galaxy, Groove Shark, TuneIn Radio, and TuneIn Radio Pro. I personally like having mine set to Pandora, but it's just whatever you like. In the mail app, they added Sparrow, and I'm a really big fan of Sparrow, so I went ahead and selected my mail client to be Sparrow. Here's your custom actions. We already went through those. Here's six preset applications that you can choose. Application one, you see, is my messages. Application two is phone. Application three is music. Okay, so let's see where those are at. Open up deck. So it looks like right here was what that was referring to. Or was it? No, it was these. Um, Deck is a pretty cool tweet, guys, or, or application, however you want to refer to it. I personally really enjoy using it. You can get it for $1.99 in the Mod My I repo. But before you leave, be sure to hit that subscribe button. It really helps me out. Come over to iPhoneCaptain.com. Subscribe to my RSS feed here. If you don't know how to do that, check it out. And that way, every time I post an update on my website, you'll know that I've posted a new one, which is almost about every day. 
But anyway, if you'll subscribe to my RSS feed, you'll know exactly when I do update. So come over to iPhoneCaptain.com, subscribe, and keep coming back.